Hello everyone, and here we go. We're at the Wanda Metropolitano. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. And we're talking about the last eight in the Premier Cup. It's Spain against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, a semi-final place is up for grabs, so we should be in for a classic encounter here today. With both teams desperate for silverware, I'm expecting a fiercely competitive contest, Derek. Here's the lineup for Spain. David De Gea stands between the posts. Emeric Laporte starts with Sergio Ramos at the back. Marcos Llorente starts alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And Morata is the main striker for this match. Now the pass not finding its target. Jordi Alba. Marcos Llorente has it. Rodri. They really look after the ball when they have it. And just like that, they don't have the ball anymore. Oh, nice ball over the top to Chase. Excellent position taken up by Mbappe. The high press was on, and the chance is on. And the PSG team looks like this. Gianluigi Donnarumma is the keeper. Sergio Ramos plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Idrissa Gay plays alongside Marco Verratti in the engine room. And lining up through the middle in attack today is Kylian Mbappe. And he's in. Sensational goalkeeping from David De Gea. And he's fired over the corner. Well, the danger is still there. Threat over for now, it seems. Oyar Sabal. This looks threatening. In it goes! The goal for 1-0, and that changes the dynamic. Well, here it is again, and it was never really in doubt, was it? He was always going to score from there. And the ball is moving again, and the question is, how will PSG reply to that setback? And Neymar! Chance, maybe! And off the post! But the assistant referee has his flag raised. Morata. The ball with Rodri. And they continue to advance. Majestic piece of goalkeeping. Well, he loves the big moments, doesn't he? And he's proved it again there. Great goalkeeping. And a short corner here. Cuts it back. Textbook defending inside the box. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Neymar. Di Maria. Can they put it away? Still alive. Not a time for cool heads. Well, they're creating chances. They now just need to take one of them. Mind you, what a save that was. Wanted to keep it, but couldn't. It is to be a throw-in. Oyar Sabal. Crossing opportunity. Teammate and support. Oh, incredible save, and he snuffed out the danger. Neymar. Now with Messi. Idrissa Gay. Mbappe. Good defending. 
Well, half time coming up shortly, and the home side on top. Stuart, interested to get your critique. Well, it's been a tight game so far, but they've just had that little bit more quality on the ball, particularly in midfield, where they've just started to take control. They'll be fairly happy going at half time if it stays like this. Good pressure. Can they make something of this? Well, let's see about the cross. Oh, good save. Excellent header. Well, offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. Mbappe. Well, he failed to get it away properly. And will it be the leveller? And up for grabs off the keeper. Not a good pass. Neymar thrives on running at defenders. Well, just the tackle that was needed. Gay. And beating the defender. Hakimi. Messi. Breaking at pace. And let's give credit to the defending. Well, a poor attempt at a challenge, and on he goes. Superb block. Splendid tackle, and the outcome is a corner here. And they're going for the short one. Moreno. On to Jordi Alba. And Messi in full control of the ball here. Neymar waiting to pounce. That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. It's Neymar's corner. Well, the danger is still there. And a big moment because the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty coming up. Well, his name and number have been taken as well, Stuart. And quite rightly so. It was a poor challenge. He was right to give a penalty to the referee, and he's right to give the yellow card. An opportunity to level matters. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, the ball is moving again, and work to do for Paris Saint-Germain in the second half. Idrissa Gay. Moving the ball nicely, trying to carve out the equaliser. Well, sadly, they just couldn't keep possession. Bodies forward, and the break looks on. Well, they profit from this situation. And throwing himself at the ball. In the short corner, let's see. Moreno. A glorious chance. There it is. And he could scarcely have had an easier finish. Well, here it is again. It's an easy finish in the end. But what was the keeper thinking? That's a poor bit of defending. So 2-0 now. And he's thwarted him almost effortlessly.
Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Opportunity for Reno. And diving to thwart it. Substitution time it is here. Who can they pick out? Well, the clearance half-hearted. Reading it well. What an important piece of defending. Short corner taken. Moreno. It's with Oyar Sabal. Llorente. Perfect tackle. But it did look dangerous for a moment, but the keeper has it now. This might be ideal for the counter. A chance for him to get in behind, maybe. Pivotal moment defensively. Attacking possibilities for PSG. Options in the middle. Di Maria. Oh, he's given it. The referee says penalty. And an opportunity for them to pull one back here. Well, some might say he's been fortunate to avoid being shown the card. Well, I like that from the referee. Just because it's a penalty doesn't mean it's a yellow card. I think he's got it right. This to get themselves back into it. And a timely penalty save. It's a short corner. Can he get one back? Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Ferran Torres. Moreno. And a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Tremendous defensive acumen from Laporte. And this would reduce the deficit. And oh, it's in! We cannot declare this contest over. They still believe. And away they go once more. And plenty still for Paris Saint-Germain to fire at in this game. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. But they took care of the situation defensively. Intercepting it intelligently. 20 minutes to go in this one. Space and time for the cross. An absolutely breathtaking spell. We were ready to write them off, but not anymore. All square now. Well, back underway here, and they've split the four goals between them so far. And he was in the right place to intercept. Wants to attack from the wide areas. But nothing comes of it. Now, let's see what they can do here. Did have the ball, but not anymore. Well, I have to say, these fans are doing everything to drive their team forward here. Marcos Llorente. The ball with Rodri. And they find a gap in the defence. Llorente. 
Can they forge ahead? Terrific block there. Well, great read there to intercept. But he tried in vain to get himself back onside. Well, he needs to show greater awareness there and hold on to the ball a fraction longer. Ten minutes left for play. Progressive football from Paris Saint-Germain. They know a goal at this late stage might be decisive. No way through. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Morata! Oh, just narrowly off target. Well, they broke with such pace and intent. Fantastic move. Just couldn't quite cap it off. And the referee will go back now to the earlier incident. Yellow card it is. Neymar wishes he had that passing opportunity back. Must take the lead here. And they do. And with so little time left, that will surely be decisive. Astonishing drama. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. They're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Oh, great attacking play. Wanted to keep it, but couldn't. We've had the official word, there will be a minimum of two. This could finish it! Thwarting him, constantly thwarted. Morata! Oh, he squandered the chance, and he knows it. Well, it wouldn't have counted anyway, he was offside. But nonetheless, that was a poor attempt. The referee blows for full time, it ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. Well, Derek, what a good finish to the game that was. They just wore down the opposition.